This is Matrix Lord 212 when I'm reviewing <clears throat> Fantastic Four number 14. Okay, so we learn in this issue that uh, Reed Richards had took the original rocket, the Marvel 1, out of storage and put it in a museum. And he was marveling at, you know, their first adventure and how everything went wrong. And But it was a beautiful rocket and Valeria thought that it was antiquated because, again, for the time, the technology was terrible and the design was terrible. Um, and then we got to see, you know, people like discriminating against Ben Grimm because he's a monster still a little bit. He has to deal with that. Uh, we also saw that there was supposed to be two other members that was supposed to be Ben Grimm and Reed Richards, not Sue and Johnny. It was supposed to be these other two, but Ben Grimm may, you know, went with Sue and Johnny. Um, and they had lived their lives and they are happy and they have a family and they said they would never trade it for the world because they would never want to become an ugly thing, which that got Human Torch pissed off. Um, but they went home and Reed Richard was replaying the, the rocket in his head. Actually, before that, Ben played the black box and he heard, reheard everything that happened when they got their powers. And it was just shocking to him, you know, to listen to the past like that. When they got home and Reed Richards went to bed, he, he couldn't sleep, so he was planning on rebuilding a new version of the Marvel, make it Marvel 2 rocket. And, you know, also we had a, a flashback of the Human Torch when he was desperately wanted to be part of the crew. He was going to all these tests and he felt that it was destiny for him to go to this planet that they were going to go to because he just felt, you know, something about it. <clears throat> and Ben Grimm was like making fun of it back in the past. But even the Human Torch wanted to go to that planet because they said it was hab habitable with life and they never got to go there. They just through everything that happened. They got their powers. They just never completed the mission. So Reed rebuilds with Johnny without their powers, the new rocket. And they all, you know, Ben Grimm was against it. He didn't want to go. And Reed Richards swore that the shielding was 10 times better this time. So they wound up Ben, ben gives in and he winds up going. They tried to trick him, like make it like there was a Herbie robot in there, but it was all an act. Um, and Alicia Masters pe packed, you know, him a lunch, which that, you know, she's his, that's his wife. And he decided to go with them and they decided to rock it off into space into um, this new adventure to see this planet. Uh, so it's called Point of Origin Storyline. So I really, really enjoyed it. It is a jumping on point, I believe. Um, Dan Slott knocked it out of the park. It was really heartwarming and very informative and was really good. And I enjoyed it. So I can't wait to see what happens next. All right, guys. Take care. Bye for now.